Right, Mr. David Cameron, Greensill. Greensill is Dues Finance, Barclays Bank, owned by me. Right. So, why you owe me in March, get it illegally. Mm -hmm. You took, right? Mm -hmm. You took my finance company and you bankrupted it. Lobbying, right? You called it. Thank you, my friend. God bless you. Yeah, um, Greensill. You called it Greensill because the colour of Marsh days and also uh, those prisons is green. So you called it Greensill Finance, where it's Barclays Bank. And my bonds and shares in the names of Hamer, G. Hamer, W. W. Hames. David Michael Haynes, and David Michael Hamer, both actually, etc. Right, <clears throat> when you stole them, like I said, with the shares to do motor group, they were wrapped in a treasury application form for a treasury loan off the balance of the sum of the loan, no, of the bonds. So, you've also accessed the treasury loan from the government stolen billions and billions of pounds from these COVID grants and payments that you've been giving your family, right, and other people, where, wherever it's been going, right, you stole it from the treasury, making out you've loaned money from around it, you stole it from the treasury through the treasury loan scheme, because uh, I'm a bonded man, and the bonds were share certificates for the Bank of England and the Bank of Ireland, like I said to everyone on the other channel, so, so now you've stolen between yourselves billions and billions of pounds of the taxpayers' money and my money and our investment money, right? And done what the fuck with it? Hmm? So, I believe you might be lining your own pockets with our cash. But I'm not very impressed and not very happy about this, I'm afraid. Like when Theresa May was on fucking Kettlewell's buses in Metford, take the fucking uh, checkbooks from me. Like I said, I'll snap your fucking fingers off. So, when you had me promptly arrested, but then again, you were fucking there uh, looking around my properties, like the NCP car park that you put on the forecourts and the rear courts and that, and the yards, the bonded yards in Halifax while I was in prison fighting the case, which I did win public. YouTubers, I won and I left the prison with all the bonds and shares, uh, with the keys to all the offices, right? And I'm very fucking sorry and you're a fucking foreigner. What do you mean I'm a foreigner? I was born in Northamptonshire. I was fucking christened in Cyprus so they could smuggle me the fuck back when I was a baba, right? And yes, they are a paedophile ring. And yes, they did distribute fucking images of me as a child. Around them. so, when you think you're fucking clever for the things you bastards have been part of, right? You're a disgusting bunch of dirty, horrible fucking mongrels. You and your families that have been part of this, right? You followed me and fucking stalked me, right? And caused me grief and fucking shit all my life, right? Because you think I'm some sort of fucking victim, you bastard, sex offending mongrel cunts, right? You disgusting, horrible fucking freaks. So, when you all think you're funny and you're clever, right? You facilitate a paedophile ring that's been operating in this fucking world and in this country, right? Since the mid fucking 70s. So, behave your fucking selves, you dirty bastards. You fucking dogs, right? Because I'm sick of this, right? Some sort of fucking weirdo fucking internet freak show. You all are, right? So, stop it. Because I will bring you to fucking justice. And if justice is you being put the fuck down, you diseased fucking animals, then that's what I shall have done. So now you stop this, you perverted fucking freaks, right? Stealing people's money and people's shit and doing the fucking things you've done to me and other children and other people around this fucking country is disgusting. So, now you took me as a fucking child and you've cunted my fucking life ever since, 
right? For fucking money and control and your perverted fucking paedophile.